patchouli. That's my dog. Oh, is your dog vegan too? I know you are. Um, yeah, she's vegan now. When she was a puppy, she wasn't because there wasn't like vegan puppy food. But yeah, vegan dog food now. What do you feed your dog? Um, I feed her natural balance, but she loves peanut butter. Ooh, what kind of peanut butter do you use? Well, she's a big fan of crunchy. Kroger brand. Just the natural. <laughs> Very nice. No added sugar. I guess this is Adam. This is Adam. This is Hi. my husband. Hi, Adam. Hey. What were you just doing? Just cleaning. Do you prefer baths or showers? Here you go. Here you go. <laughs> well, I hate washing my hair, so I'm going to say baths. Because normally I only wash my hair like twice a week and then a shower. <laughs> That's awesome. <laughs> what kind of shampoo do you use? Um, I use a natural one. Um, it's by a girl here in town. She does a zero waste pop-up. And yeah, so it's this one. I refill this every month, or every two. Oh, cool. That's awesome. Yeah. She's a local business? Yeah, she is. The Good Fill. That's so cool. I saw a woman walking around here. Who's that? Oh, it's my mom. Hey, oh. Mom. Hi, Mom. Hi. Her name is Carrie. Does she live in town? So, she is from North Carolina. She lives in North Carolina, but she's visiting for the weekend for Mother's Day. Wow. Oh, happy Mother's Day. Oh, happy Mother's Day. Thanks. Did you grow up with a big family? Yeah, so, I mean, it depends on what you mean by big family. I have three siblings, and, yeah, and we have a dog. And we had lots of cats growing up, too. Oh, cats? Yes. What was your favorite cat? Um, well, that's hard to say. It's like trying to pick a favorite sibling. Um, True. So, I would say Tigger Luke. I loved him. Oh, what a cool name. Yeah. That's so fun. Right. What's your guilty pleasure? Okay, so... I think it's eating buttered noodles in the morning for breakfast, just my guilty pleasure. What? Yeah. So I'm guessing you like salty, not sweet. Oh yeah, I'm definitely a savory for sure. Who's the most inspirational human you follow right now? Um, honestly, I've really been into the Enneagram stuff right now. So Enneagram and coffee, Enneagram life, I think. So anything that I get to like learn basically more about myself and my friends. Cool. Yeah. What's your favorite restaurant in town? I'd say my go-to is Gray's because it's a vegan, it's a vegan restaurant in town and it's got really good food. Or or the Beehive, which is the vegan deli. Ooh, yum. Do you eat out a lot? Um, no. I don't. We make a lot of food. Adam and I cook a lot. Cool. Yeah. Would you rather have more stuff or less? Um, less. Yeah. Definitely less. Adam and I share a closet and we literally share one dresser. Like, no way! Between the two of us. Yeah. You guys, I'm guessing, don't have that much clothing then. No, definitely not. Minimalist for sure. Yes. What's something no one would guess about you? Mm, I used to be on the Appalachian ski race team. Appalachian! Yeah. Cool. Do you ski anymore? Um, like once a year, like with the fam. Everybody in the family skis and. Yeah, it's just like, it's fun to do. How long have you been skiing? Since I was eight. I think, yeah, I think I was eight. Before that, I was trying to ski in between my dad's legs, and one day he just like stopped. <laughs> we were Aww. going down the hill and he let me go. And, but I learned. It was a good learning day for me. So your dad taught you to ski? Yeah, he did. So like I said, he like had me between his legs until one day <laughs> he let me go. <laughs> oh my gosh. Yeah. What a sweet dad for teaching you though. Yeah, for sure. He's the best. Who's changed your life the most mm. in this season of life? Well, my husband's pretty <laughs> awesome and he has helped me grow and change into who I am. He's helped me blossom into the flower that I am today. Cute. Um, so yeah, I'd say, I'd say that guy. That's so sweet. Yeah. What are you guys going to do tonight? Um, so we have uh, some friends that just moved into a new house and so they have a housewarming party and yeah, we're going to hang out with them. Housewarming party? Mm -hmm. Are you more spontaneous or are you structured? Um, if I have any kind of inkling that there is a plan, a game plan, I want to know what's going to happen. Otherwise, I'm pretty spontaneous. What's your go-to clothing item? Um, I'm not wearing it right now, but oversized sweaters. Great oh, oversized sweaters. Nice. <laughs> yeah. So, do you like the cold or the hot? Hot. Always. I wear sweaters and I wear... Socks and I wear sweatpants in the summer. I just, I love to be warm. What was the last thing you texted? 
Um, let's see. Come in the back. <laughs> Text that to my mom. She was uh, on her way here, so I told her to walk in the back door. Oh, there you go. Yeah. Who do you want to be when you grow up? Mm, that's a hard one. Michelle Obama. <laughs> wow. Okay. <laughs> yeah. How did you feel about this interview? Um, I feel pretty good. I, I feel like, you know, this is my home, so I feel like I'm in a comfortable spot. And, yeah, I feel like you're pretty cool, so. Aw, thanks so much. I had a good time. I hope you did, too. I did. Thanks so much. Here you go. Thanks. Enjoy. Bye. Bye.